I really enjoy doing portrait photography. I like doing portraits of, of candid shots, if I can get them. Um, but I love doing portraits of tribal people in the outback. I find that their faces tell their whole history, their whole story. It's just wonderful. I purchased my first camera when I was in my early teens and I've hardly had one out of reach ever since. So it's been a long time. Probably the photograph that I believe is the best I've ever taken is the photograph of have of Uluru with a storm cloud just sitting on the top of it. And when I contacted Uluru and said I had a great photograph, they said, please don't send, we get probably 600 a week. I had it enlarged, pretty big, sent it up, and I got a beautiful letter saying that the elders were putting it in their boardroom. It was also published worldwide in Leica Photographic Magazine. I had a fantastic photographic trip, early 2000s. It was the World Hot Air Balloon Championships at Mildura. I took a photograph of a balloon below me and I could see a car coming from about, I don't know, a kilometre away and I was hoping to get it in the shot. And I asked the, the pilot, can you slow this thing down? He said, mate, I can make it go up and I can make it go down, but I can't make it go sideways or backwards or forwards. And I took the shot and I was using film and I had to wait four weeks till I got back to Melbourne and had it developed. I did another hot air balloon and I took a photograph of a ploughed wheat field. Now, both the hot air balloon and the ploughed wheat field, they were published in Australia Photographic Magazine, double page spread with nice big prizes, which was great. The Australia Day Council of New South Wales, together with Australia Post, run a Australia-wide photographic competition. They've been doing it for the last three years. I was a runner-up in 2010, and in 2011, I was awarded a stamp to be made in the image that I had sent in. There were 3,900 entries, and I was one of five chosen. To have my photograph, produced as a stamp by Australia Post is probably the greatest accolade that one could have as a photographer. I mean, it's just amazing. And that's something that hopefully my children and grandchildren and maybe great-grandchildren, that, that's something to show them, well, this is what the grandfather did. You know, everyone looks now into ancestry. He was a photographer and they did a stamp of his photo. Pretty chuffed I was about that. I think a bit of good advice for photographers, which is what I've learned by reading and listening and all along the way is, when you have composed the shot and you think, oh, that is fantastic, I've really got that, take a step or two forward, then click the shutter. Gotcha. Gotcha.